This was a moment ago at the 13th hole. Pajari Ananarukan not having a great day. Yeah, this might turn it around. It might turn it around. It does. An ace. Lilia Vu for a birdie at the first. Yes! Lilia Vu. First one of the day. First birdie on the first hole. At uh, the second, Shi Yu Lin. Yes! Oh, oh, nice putt. Gabby Lopez. Third for a birdie. And another one goes in. Smooth greens early. Absolutely beautiful. And second. She's got a putt to get it under par for the championship. Very talented play. Hits the ball a long way. Charlie Hall. I don't know how long it's going to stay around, but there was a brief moment where we saw Charlie's shadow. And by the time she pulled the putter back, it was gone. And up ahead at the first green, Yamashita. A moment ago for birdie. And watch out for the best player from the JLPGA last year, Yavu, the reigning player of the year. Back last week, beat Lexi in that playoff in her first event since March. Yeah, I had struggled with a back injury, but what a way to come back last week. This is Jennifer Cupcho. You can see the flag tucked over on the right side today at this part three. Safe players to go at the tower there, but a lot of players have gone straight at the flag, including Cupcho getting it to stop. What a shot. This is Ali Ewing. Birdie putt at the third. Ali, if you remember, made a nice charge on Sunday at the U.S. Women's Open at Lancaster Country Club, trying to make a charge on Saturday here at a major. That was really well done. Lexi Thompson at the second. And she's really seen pay dividends with this club in her hands. Over at the par 5 6, big hitting Bianca Pogdanan for birdie. She has good memories here, won a collegiate tournament here at Sahali. Lauren Hartledge, the 26 year old from Kentucky, in her third season on the LPGA Tour. A big finish, Morgan, yesterday, birdied five of her last seven holes and picks up one here. Looks good, yeah, really good. And Haydan Yu moves within one of the lead with back to back birdies. To the seventh. It's a moment ago, Caroline Inglis, who's a resident of the state of Washington, lives in Vancouver, Washington. Just made a birdie on the previous hole, and another one goes in. So that's back to back birdies. She gets to two under par for the championship, only four behind. It's nice to have this kind of club into these tricky greens. It's the third pitching wedge she's hit today. She's hit a lot of good shots, Morgan. Yeah, she's played very solid golf. And it's surrounded five. Out of a fried egg lie. That is tremendous. Oh, my goodness. Our five sixth, Madeline Sackstrom for birdie. And with Madeline's length, you expect her to take advantage of this par five that's been shortened today. And Shibuno for the birdie. This was a moment ago. Pretty straight putt overall. Straight in the hole, yeah. set up 
way outside of this hole to the left. What a solid stroke. Only about three feet and had to play that a half a cup outside the hole on the left to square up her shoulders. Yeah, center. Knocked it in. A three tied at the top here. At the 10th, Charlie Hull, the chance to get to two under. Just four shots back. Yamashita trying to salvage a par at the eighth. She is incredible. Amy has been the queen of getting it up and down this week. This is straightforward, low chip and run shot. A lot of green to work with. I mean, what a par this is going to be after that tee shot. It's an eagle putt here for Caroline Inglis. This was a moment ago. Talked about the tee being moved up, and it's possible, yes. That's a big move. And that drops Charlie, very comfortable on tree-lined courses. She Wait, way on her front foot with this upslope. Is it enough? Yes, Charlie with a third straight birdie. something there that was really good it's the 15 Lily of Vu for birdie she's starting to feel it as well so Lilia gets it to three under and another name in contention here we yeah nice response Got so many holes without dropping a shot. Drops one at eight and then bounces right back with the birdie at nine. Hartledge on the tee at the 13th. Aaron Hartledge having a really good week, getting even better. What a shot. Essentially giving her a birdie, assuming she's going to two put this. Well, this I, I think she's got a good chance, Kate. This is really tough. Let's see if she dials it in. Just going to put the brakes on now. Oh, pretty good. Let's check in with Madeline Sagstrom. This is at the 13th for a birdie. Oh, long range one. Why not? That's her fourth birdie of the day. It's a second two today. At the 12th, hit on you scrambling her fourth. This 89 yards, and again, this group you mentioned were warned, now officially on the clock. At least good recovery there. Alexi at 13. Wants to die from her left to right. Yeah. 14th and Japan's Yamashita. This could be a life-changing week. This is Caroline Inglis in the bunker, a little downhill lie, not easy. Played it very well indeed. Very well indeed. Second shot for Lauren Hartledge at 16. She has her coach Grant Waite out here with her. They were grinding on the range ahead of this round. Virtual tap in here to get into a share of second. Less than 50 starts. Uh, he's still got a chance here tomorrow, especially if she can hold this one. Yeah, right with some speed. And she's got 135 to the hole. This is a smooth seven on. Back into the wind a little bit. And just sawed off that finish, trying to control it under the wind. Karen, beautifully done. Moment now time for Biff. 15. Birdie putt for Shibuno, and she makes it. Right, a par putt for Hinako Shibuno at 16. Yeah, right to left breaking putt from the lower level up to the top. 
Oh, look at this. Kay has three less bogeys than any player in the field this week. Uh, but now two, that was a misread. Yeah, that was one of those that you, look, you think it goes left to right, but it's actually almost straight or even goes the opposite way. Yeah, only our sixth bogey of the week. Movement on this green, pretty flat by the hole. Oh, she read it well. Did she read it well? Yeah. And Amy Ann straight back to seven under par. Look at the response. Of the Uh, what an effort. <laughs> this week, her stroke has really looked the best it's ever seen. 73 with that closing birdie. Okay. Former number one in the world, like Lexi, a closing birdie. I'm old school. Just trying to get something over that ridge, and she does it to perfection. Mm, okay, well, she did have a three-shot lead entering the final round of the 2015 U.S. Women's Open. Amy Yang trying to win her first major. Lauren Hartlich, Miyu Yamashita, Sarah Schmelzel, Caroline English trying to win their first tournament ever.